What I like to do is get, um, you know, get if it's a, I start software businesses, so that's what I like to do, and I like to get, you know, the idea um, built out enough where I can actually put it in front of somebody and have them use it, and if you know I find that at least, you know, uh, you know, ten people are using it, so I'll you know go out and and try to get ten people to start using it, and not just using it, but actually using it actively. Um, that's a pretty good you know, sign for me. But ultimately, I found that you can talk to, um, you can do as much research as you possibly can, but you never really know until you've got the product or the service in the market. Uh, and if you can figure out what is that sort of minimal viable amount of investment in a product or service that you need to make so that you can actually give it to somebody so they can use it and consume it and try it and give you feedback, that'll probably be much better than, you know, trying to survey a thousand people or two thousand people. I, I've just found that nothing replaces actually having uh, something that you can put in somebody's hands or something that you can give people so they can actually see how their real problem that they're actually having can be solved by whatever you have to build. Um, you know, with Involver, as I told you, we had this uh, idea to distribute videos on um, on Facebook. And so rather than actually building out the entire software to create a video campaign management platform and analytics and all of that, we actually ended up going to a firm in India that built a white label YouTube platform. We paid them, I think it was three or four hundred dollars, got them to do a little bit of configuration, but not much. And uh, we had a product that we could put in people's hands within about two or three weeks with very low investment. But it would have been much, much better than me calling up a bunch of nonprofits or small businesses or brands and saying, what do you think about the idea of distributing your videos on Facebook? Would you do that? I'm sure, you know, I might get a bunch of people that would say yes and a bunch of people that wouldn't know what the hell I'm talking about. But ultimately, the only thing that really gave us concrete feedback was putting a product in, in someone's hands. And, and we found a very low cost way of doing it in a short period of time and I'd encourage you guys to do the same thing.